Hello, my name is Todd Leroy, Vice President of Manufacturing. I've been with Lowen's for 41 years. Lowen Windows is a supplier of premium windows and doors in North America. When I first started in health and safety, you know, there were no safety glasses. There, were no, no, there was no hearing protection. Uh, those are a couple of things I implemented in the first couple of years. There were no safety shoes. Uh, so those are some of the things that have, you know, the fundamentals that have changed. Safety is the, you know, everybody's responsibility, but ultimately when the accountability comes down to senior leadership like myself, we're the ones that not just put the policies in place, but ensure they're enforced and that they're, uh, that they're seen as a priority. Uh, and so it's part of, the, part of every conversation and meeting that we have here at Lowen's is safety. It can be a tough journey if you don't have someone to walk alongside you. And I think CME is that partner who has a lot of resources that we uh, leverage all the time. We have, uh, you know, they, they provide training, insights, and you know, we can talk to them and say, hey, you guys get to see all these different companies. Who's got the best practice when it comes to this or who's got the best practice when it comes to that? Who can we go talk to about how they're doing this? Because this is an opportunity for us. And then the Safe Work certification, looking for anything and everything that could help make us better. It's not like we needed or we had a bad safety program, but when the safety certification became available, we said, hey, if this can make us 1% better, then why wouldn't we want to do that? So we were one of the first five companies within Manitoba that became safety certified. Our productivity was growing, and I do directly relate that to being safer, because if people aren't being injured, uh, they're able to do their jobs well and not have to worry about things. So our productivity was, has, has continued to get better over the last number of years. I think about my people constantly. I drafted a, an email to my, my team this morning, said, okay guys, we need to get together. We got our team meeting tomorrow. I want to talk about what we're doing differently in 2023 for safety and a bunch of other things. What are we going to do differently, guys? What are we going to, what are we going to make happen to improve everything we do? And so, you know, I drafted that, that memo, sent it to him this morning, and tomorrow afternoon, we're going to sit down and say, okay guys, safety, what are we going to do differently? What do we think we can do better? Todd is just a genuine, caring person. And I think he thinks people first. We have a business that we're running here and he has a, you know, a huge responsibility when it comes to business in general. And, you know, you can talk about your targets and you can talk about your productivity and, and all that. Um, but he's always thinking about safety first. He's very focused on that. Um, just very knowledgeable and caring and genuine when it comes to making sure that people work safely, go home to their families. I think he'll always be remembered as somebody who started off on the floor, like he started off working in the shipping docks, loading windows. Um, he has driven changes right from the very beginning on throughout the company and has done just about every job that there is but safety's always been behind everything that he's made a decision on. So I think the fact that, that he has been here and driving that for so many years will be something everybody will always remember. It's just people, I care about people. You know, my, my, my own children worked here. Uh, in fact, one of them still does. Uh, but my kids, when they were going to school before they went to college and university, they came here and worked summers. And so, uh, you know, it was important to me and, and I, I say this to my, my leadership team is, is, you know, these are our family. These are our kids. We have to take care of them. So think of these people as your family uh, and take care of them. And so that's why it's important to me. They're, they're, my, they're my family. I got a call from Neil Curry from MadeSafe and he asked me if I'd be willing to, you know, that they were you know, creating this new award and if I'd be willing to accept it. And I says, wow, I wasn't expecting this. So again, proud of the fact that uh, I've been recognized. I don't do these things to, to win awards. I do this so that my people will be safe every day and go home to their families. Um, but proud of the fact that uh, I was recognized to be the first. It's always good to be number one, the first one. But, uh, but again, um, mostly uh, just humbled to be, to be recognized.